question on this, any doubt on this? Now, once I am able to see that I am there and the body is there, right? What I would want to do next? Is to ask this question. As to what is the interaction taking place between the self and the body? So there are two distinct realities and they are in coexistence. Now in step two, we are asking what is this transaction taking place between the self and body which are in coexistence. So step two is observing the interaction between the self and the body by the self. So the question is what is the interaction between me and the body? Is it exchange of information or is it exchange of physiochemical things, material things? What is being transacted between self and body? So if I look at this, I can see that I am giving some instruction to the body and I am reading some sensation from the body. That is the transaction. I am giving some instruction to the body, I am reading some sensation from the body. This is the transaction taking place between the two. So instruction is given from the self to the body. This is one transaction which is taking place. And this giving instruction to the body Basically, it is transaction of information. <clears throat> Second is, there is reading of sensation from the body to the self. So on the basis of events taking place in the body, sensations are taking place. I read some of the sensations. I taste the sensations that I read you know uh, read you know so i will read the sensation from the body and i will taste it now what i get here is some information so sensation is also an information so let us take this example it will clarify both these parts suppose i want to eat you know, I happen to recall the taste of rasgulla and I, you know, which I happen to like. Now, on the basis of this, I decide to, you know, eat that sweet, that rasgulla, you know, which I had happened to like. So I will ask the body to get up, walk to the, you know, sweet shop, take out the money, pay it, you know, take this sweet, put it in your mouth, right? chew it, all those things. So I am giving this instruction to the body and the body is doing accordingly. Now when the sweet is purchased, you know, and you are eating it, there you are putting, you know, that uh, sweet in your tongue, right? And when your tongue comes in contact with the sweet, there is some sensation. There is some sensation. And you can read that sensation. And by reading that sensation, 
you get some information about the test of the fit. And if it happens to match with your expectation, your liking, you feel happy about it. If it mismatches with your expectation, with your test, then you will feel unhappy. But important thing is that, yes, some information I am giving to the body, some information coming from the body in the form of sensation. Next. So let's look at this. From now onward till tomorrow morning, we'll try to observe this. We'll try to observe step one, the time there and the body is there. In step two, we'll try to observe that there is transaction taking place between me and the body. Right. And this transaction is in the form of information. So I'm giving some instruction to the body, which is certainly an, you know, kind of information. And I'm reading some sensation from the body, which is also the transaction of information. There is no physical transformation. There is no material transformation taking place. So, can you see this? So, this is what we will try to look at, explore, investigate in step two. I am there, my body is there. There is transaction taking place between me and the body. And the form of transaction is that I am giving some information to the body and I'm reading some information from the body. So let us look at this step two of exercise two. And if there is any clarification required, I can certainly take up Step one, exercise two, or step two, exercise two. If there is any clarification required, I would like to do that. Otherwise, we can work with this step two from now onward till tomorrow morning.